SGC here, and we're back for first impression. Devilman Crybaby. And it's done by Science Saru Animation, and looking at their AnimeNewsNetwork.com profile, they seem to not have done anything in terms of actual producing an entire series. So that's kind of interesting, because I'll, I'll talk about that later. But basically, they did a lot of animation openings or production on a movie called uh, Nice called uh, Night is Short, Walk on Girl. The anime production was on that. They worked on Space Dandy Season 2, production Cooperation, Cooperation, Episode 3, Key Animation on Typhoon Naruda, which was the movie. And we also have uh, Iga Crayon Shinchan. Oh yeah. They did animation for one of the battles. And they also assisted in the movie. Actually, it was a movie. Movie 22 and movie 23. But anyways, this is a relatively new studio and i dig it i dug it dug it dug it dug it dug it dug it okay first off if you don't know this is a japanese anime series based on go nagai's manga called devil man directed by masaki yuasa and is written by ichiro okuchi and it's uh a netflix original series and it aired this month so it's five episodes lie 10. 10 episodes, and from Wikipedia, we have that it's basically about a dude who's informed by his best friend that an ancient race of demons have returned and to take back the world from the humans. And uh, believing uh, that the only way to defeat the humans is to incorporate their powers, Ryo suggests to Akira that he unite with a demon. I don't think he really suggested, it just happened. And then Akira transforms into Devil Man, possessing the powers of a demon, but retaining the soul of a human. So, um, I actually have a manga that sort of coincides with this. So I have uh, Devil Man G, Grom, Grimoire. So there's this, and I read a bit of it, and I mean, it's by, I think it's a series. Uh, no, it's a modern ultraviolet spin on the devilish classic by the same dude, so... Read that, that was interesting. And it's different from the TV series, but it's still pretty bloody. And I like how Sain Saru dealt with the animation for this, because it's loose and more artistic, in a sense where it's just more artsy, not very, what's the word? I, I don't know the word, but it's not realistic, so, the proportions are off for some shots, and it just gives it more off-worldedness. There's twerking in this, which was surprising, because I don't think I've seen twerking in that level, on that level, for an anime. And there's nudity, so, uh, yeah, there's nudity. Also different, and there's a lot of blood, and the monster transformations were very interesting. I guess, give props for the animation for that. Like, oh, you changed it into that monster from this human body. Interesting. So as the first episode, nothing really is set up in terms of... Is that true? It is. Like, we, we learn about Akira, and then he has a crush on this girl, and then Ryo shows up from nowhere, and then he gets Devil Man, becomes Devil Man, kills things, and now it's set up that he's going to kill more devils or demons or what have you. I guess so they did set up everything. But it's not intriguingly set up in the sense where we're like, oh, very, I want to watch the rest of the season. For me, anyways. I think for me, I will watch the rest of the season strictly on the animation and the fact that people are divided on this. That's the only reason we even found out that, oh yeah, this is out. I always forget. I get informed by news articles. But uh, yeah, so I enjoy the animation. It's loose and just gory and it's intense. A lot of people died in the first episode, so that's kind of interesting. I'm seriously hoping for like... Ah, you can't see it. It's not in the background. Where is my Helsing series? But Helsing! Holy smokes! I want some Helsing back, guys, because that was amazing. I mean, both series with all that blood and gore, but uh, yeah, I can't find it. But anyways, I enjoyed that, and I cannot wait. Did I say I enjoyed that? I just did. But anyways, I think I enjoyed the animation, the story's pretty generic, and just demon fighting, but I love the animation because it's so messed up. Or I wouldn't say so, but it's pretty messed up comparative to everything that's been out, and not an Isekai series, which is, oh my goodness, thank God. 
because Isekai, I'm just getting sick of you, and harder, harder for me to keep watching anime. But lo and behold, an original Netflix series that caught my eye. So I will finish this, most likely. 10 episodes, not bad, 25 minutes each. And I'll come back and I'll report back for the final impression of Devilman, the crybaby. So that is it for the first impression of Devilman Crybaby. Out.